G'day guys, welcome back to another week of building the uh, Centisma Trinidad. Hope everyone had a uh, great, great Christmas and um, the new year will treat you well. Um, because of the Christmas festivities, I've actually got about three days to get this video ready. And to start with, I've got the um, uh, cannonballs here, which are going to go around the outside edge of the um, grating that um, we fitted last week, or the week before, sorry. Um, what we have is some um, uh, brass black, which um, according to instructions, we just pour over the top. It only takes a minute to blacken these up. Um, so we just pour it over the top, just enough to cover it. They say we should need to leave it for about a minute. You can see it's already starting to work. And then we will um, empty this out, run some uh, clean water over it, and uh, I'll dry them off and then we can start uh, fitting them to the ship. So uh, we'll just give that a minute and then we'll come back. As you can see, I've already added the cannonballs to this side of the uh, grating. So now I'll do the other side uh, on camera. So I'll just use a little bit of CA glue to hold it in place. And then we'll start adding them to that uh, gap.
Okay, that's all the um, cannonballs in place on both sides. Uh, so next we'll move on to um, fitting the LEDs in place. Okay, next up we just have to make the um, battery box. We've got um, two part 63s and the big part here is 64. Uh, they just slot in either side like this. So I'll just get some um, uh, glue and we'll start putting them in place. Okay, we'll just leave that to dry for a little bit and then we'll fit it to the ship. Okay, so now we'll fit this battery box in. As you can see, there's actually three tabs along the front here which match up with these uh, three at the front and there's also three at the back which uh, the other end slots into. Uh, so we're just trying to slip it in there. So it just slips in there and these bottom notches don't have a uh, bottom to them so you've got to hold them up and I'll just uh, put a clamp over that just so it can't go anywhere while it's drying. Okay so we'll um, just leave that to dry and uh, then we'll uh, start a little bit of soldering. Okay, next up we have uh, three LEDs to fit to the front of the ship. Um, I got this kit from, uh, or lighting kit from Artisania Latina, hoping it'll make it easier. I don't have to worry about resistors or anything. Uh, I've never done LED lighting before. I haven't sold it before, so this is gonna be interesting. I've done one and it took me quite a while because it turns out I'm not very uh, good at it. I'm gonna film this but um, certainly don't take it as uh, the proper way of doing things. So if anyone does have any tips, just put them in the uh, comments and uh, I'll appreciate it. Cheers. You'll actually notice momentarily that um, I don't actually record any more of this because everything I do ends up being done um, out of shot. So I'm afraid we're going to have to jump to the uh, next part of the video. Okay, completely managed to miss that videoing. Uh, as you can see I've uh, done them uh, and they work. I just wanted to test them before I put the um, heat shrink on there. So that's what we'll do next.
Okay, so I've wired up all these um, LEDs. I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing wrong, but when I try and solder to the legs of the LED, I have a lot of trouble getting them to uh, stick on there. But where I join two wires, uh, the soldering works really well. So I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong at this point. If anyone's got any ideas, let me know. Uh, this section of uh, wire is actually 12 centimeters long. And then from that point back, that's a 50 centimeter piece of uh, wire that will go back to the uh, battery box at the end of the ship. So I'll set the camera up and we'll start filming that. Okay, uh, now we've just got to fit these um, LEDs into the uh, slot either side of the bow or just behind that bow deck right there. Um, they just slip underneath this um, frame which is quite a tight fit. It's just trying to get that uh, angle right to fit in the gap, which it doesn't want to at the moment. I'll just uh, turn that the other way, see if that helps. There we go. So then you just bend that back so it hooks in behind that tab there okay and then the other side is exactly the same down through the gap again that one's come through a little bit uh, easier and then into the slot on that side There we go. And then that third uh, wire, oh, third LED that we have, that just uh, sits into the, let's move the ship up a little bit, uh, fits into this slot in the middle here. There we go. So that's the three that go in the uh, front section there. Uh, I'll just um, put some glue to hold that in place. Where is it? Here it is. And then I'll just give that glue a few seconds to dry and then I'll uh, push these um, wires back against the frame 51 there, glue them in place. I'll do that off camera. And um, then we'll come back and uh, test the lights. Okay, as you can see, they uh, work fine. Uh, that fortunately, they're supposed to flicker like that, give a candlelight look. Uh, as I said, a short video. I've only had three days to do this one after I got mugged by a bottle of bourbon. Uh, so next week, everything should go back to normal. So I hope you join me for that. Cheers.